What is up YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm bringing you guys part two of the Supreme Spring Summer 18 leaks. So let's go ahead and get started. First of all, Drops by G tweeted this out. Yeah, no, today, four hours ago. I'm so sorry for that. So four hours ago, Drops by G tweeted this out, leaking the a picture of the Supreme Molotov tea. So again, Supreme teas are not like crazy quality, you know, and especially the newest ones, in my opinion, I don't think they like they're super like crazy pieces, you know. So what I'm trying to say with this is like the Molotov tea is not like oh crazy tea. Whatever, it's it's decent, you know. So I'm not gonna complain about it. And yeah, I wouldn't cop it, you know. Just as I said earlier, I'm not really into Supreme t-shirts, you know, I'm more I'm more about Supreme t-shirts if they're like unique type thing, but if they're like super generic, like there's no point in like copying, you know? All right, so moving on, we got the Supreme Skate Decks dropping week one. And let me tell you guys, the, the signs are crazy. Like I already like them like so much. And I don't know, maybe my next board is gonna be a Supreme board. So let's go ahead and... So as you can see, we got four different colorways for the Supreme Illegal Business Runs America. Also, we got the chicken meal skateboard deck, which is also a pretty sick board. You know, it's kind of like goofy, you know, it's like, it's different, you know, and like, that's why I like about Supreme boards are like pretty sick. I've always wanted to call it like a Supreme Gons deck, but like after seeing the illegal business controls America, like, whoa, that was sick. It's sick. I mean, even though it's kind of corny, it's on point, you know, it's on point. It has the Supreme font which I forgot what it's called, but yeah, I read an article the other day about it, it was pretty sick. But yeah, overall, getting back on the topic, yeah, the Supreme decks dropping week one are looking fucking sick, in my opinion, so I would definitely call up, like any of them, like as soon as I can, because like the deck that I have right now is like a baker from like last year, and it still haven't snapped out, I don't know why, so yeah, I'm looking forward on copying a new deck, and if it's a Supreme deck, which I've never tried, it will be dope. So let's move on with the next item. So, oh yeah, I forgot to mention, guys. I'm sorry. Um, the illegal business controls America is also gonna be portrayed in a hoodie, as you can see here. We have it in black, right? But I'm pretty sure they're gonna be releasing like other colorways, like blue, red and so on. So yeah, that's it for the legal stuff. Moving on, we got a picture. I will show this like super quick cause it's like boring information, you know. It says weekly release registrations will soon. Oh my God, yeah, yeah. Yeah, basically the registrations are gonna be up soon. So yeah, if you wanna register, be sure to go on the Supreme website. So yeah, let's move on. Wow, so boring bro. Let's move on with the better stuff. on supreme further kick off of the season they're gonna be releasing a couple of tees as you can see right here we got a mini box logo i mean it's not super hyped it's just a regular item but i mean if you're a fan of supreme tees and i mean the season's just about to start so i'm pretty sure you're gonna cop one of these tees or something all right supreme is also gonna be dropping this sick ass tee i don't know what you call this design but yeah they're also gonna be dropping this super sick crew neck with like a bunch of numbers, which I mean, I'm a fan of crew necks, but I will have to see this one on other pictures of the leaks, you know, mainly because I haven't seen it and I don't know how, like, how crazy the design is. Also, we got a floral zipper, which is like, in my opinion, I don't find it that attractive, you know, like I would, I would never cop that, you know, so yeah. Let me just move on to the next item. And we also got camel pants in blue. These are the most sick ones out of the whole like kickoff set, you know? So yeah, that's mostly it for these items. Now let's move on. And we also got the teaser for the Supreme jacket, which is pretty sick. And I, fuck, I forgot where they got inspired for this jacket. Like, oh, 
yeah, I, I forgot, I forgot. But I know they got this design from another jacket. And Supreme always does this, so I don't even know why I bother mentioning it. All right. So moving on, we got another Supreme Spring Summer 18 T. And that's gonna be the Supreme Chair T, also known as the Hosh T, Highest New York SS 18 T. So it has a pretty sick design, like that metallic lawn chair reminds me of my uncle's house and shit, you know? Pretty sick. We, I, I used to skate there like all the time before, so yeah, they used to have those chairs, so. But I, I don't know why Supreme would just like release that shit. I mean, that's just how it is. I don't see that much hype on it, although it reminds me of this house that I mentioned. So yeah, let's just move on, whatever. Moving on, we got a crazy piece, or I wouldn't say piece, I would say item from Supreme. And we got the Supreme SOG hatchet, and bruh, they're fucking releasing a hatchet, like how crazy is that? Like, I mean, knowing Supreme, I'm not surprised, but what I mean is that they're fucking releasing a hatchet, you know, like, fuck. All right, so let me know in the comments below if you're if you're gonna cop this hatchet, you know. I find it pretty crazy item. Of course, I'm gonna try to cop it, you know, once it releases, once it drops online, I'm gonna try to cop it because I try to cop like the most hype shit, like call me a hype piece, whatever. All right, but yeah, the hatchet is pretty sick item, you know. Um, yeah, that's all I have to say about the hatchet, bro. Like, I, it doesn't even surprise me that Supreme did this, like. But it's pretty sick. Moving on, we got the Supreme NBA collection. And this is pretty sick because we're gonna be having all the Supreme NBA, all the, oh, God. Fuck, it's like the third time we record this shit. Fuck. Moving on, we're also gonna be getting an NBA collaboration with Supreme again. I mean, we've seen it. We've seen that in the past already. But yeah, basically they're gonna be releasing a set of a jersey, shorts, and two colorways black and white with all the NBA teams so as you can see right here yeah pretty sick I'm not a huge fan of course because what will be the point of wearing like of wearing a t-shirt a jersey with all the different teams like what's the point of that so yeah I mean I don't know I wouldn't cop it at all but if it's hyped I will probably cop it for resale I don't know we'll have to see I'm just not a huge fan of this so let's just move on to the next item all right, moving on, we got the Supreme X NBA X Nike Air Force One mids, which we got a leaked in the past, but we didn't get an actual picture of it. We got a mock-up, and now we get to see the picture. And as you can see, we got it in two colors. We got it in white and black. I mean, I don't have a personal favorite. Let me just say, like, I'm a fan of both. But the fact that it has, like, a bunch of teams on it, like, that makes me not like it as much as I could like it. But yeah, if I get a chance to copy, I'll cop because I like Air Force One. And basically, I have never tried the mids, so I mean, why not just go for them, you know? Even though they're kind of corny and like kind of crazy on the design, like what I mean with this is that it has every, like a bunch of teams on the shoe, you know, like, fuck. But yeah, other than that, like if we get a chance to cop it, I'll cop it. And if we get a chance to resell it, I would if it's like a crazy offer, like one grand or something like that, but that's never gonna happen. And I bet these are gonna resell for like, at a maximum like 200 more or 100 more, but that's it. Like, I don't think you can get that much money off it unless it's super limited. Ah, oh, unless it's super limited. If it's super limited, that of course. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. I know like I was pretty sarcastic through the whole video, but yeah, that was basically my mood today. Like, yeah, but with all the seriousness guys, like thank you so much for watching. Like I appreciate every single viewer. And if you guys want to support the homie out, feel free to leave a like. I know I've been slacking so much on YouTube, but I want to bring you guys more content. So all you gotta do is like stay tuned and I'll be posting videos like every day or some shit. I'ma try, I'ma try. Like if you don't see a video of me tomorrow, like you can hire a hitman or some shit and kill me. But other than that, thank you so much for watching again. I appreciate every single one of you guys that are subscribed. Like we're, we're a small group right now, we're like 100. 
100 people like that's nothing right now but you guys are the most the most raw most og ones out there because you're sticking with me from the beginning so thank you for that and i hope you guys take care have a wonderful friday peace out see you guys next time